The Daylight Division is celebrating the centennial of the Sugar Pine Lumber Company by inviting the Pacific Coast region to its 2021 convention, April 22nd through 24th in Fresno, California. Fresno is centrally located within the region and easily accessible by all. We are offering an $80 early bird registration until the end of the year and hope that you will register before February 20th to assist us in planning a great convention for all of you. The Wyndham Garden at the Fresno Airport will be the host hotel and features amenities like free parking, free Wi-Fi, an on-site restaurant, and two pools. Railroads have been the lifeblood of Fresno, with the Southern Pacific arriving in 1872, 13 years before Fresno was actually incorporated. By the end of the 19th century, they were joined by the Santa Fe. Now, Southern Pacific is Union Pacific, and Santa Fe is Burlington Northern Santa Fe, BNSF, and they both are active in the Fresno area. Amtrak still serves Fresno with eight trains daily. Fresno is now served by the San Joaquin Valley Railroad with rails radiating out from Fresno. From the map, you can see how Fresno serves as a rail hub for California's Central Valley. We are celebrating the 100th anniversary of the start of the Sugar Pine Lumber Company that operated a large mill at Pinedale in northern Fresno, with rail reaching into the southern Sierra. Their minarets and western common carrier brought logs down from central camp in the heart of the Sugar Pine country. Employing hundreds at the mill and in the woods, Sugar Pine Lumber was one of the first class operations in the 1920s. They are well known for their saddle tank Mikados that ran on top quality track and construction. To the east of Fresno, Southern California Edison built the San Joaquin and Eastern Railroad to help build the dams and hydroelectric power structure that lighted Southern California. We are offering two train excursions, one before and one during the convention, with dinner provided on both. The day before the convention actually starts, we will visit the Hillcrest and Watoki Railroad, a 15-inch gauge railroad near Reedley, east of Fresno. The railroad has its own uh, has over a mile of track, much of it dual gauge. The excursion includes a tour of the shop, a train ride, and an all-you-can-eat taco bar dinner. Every attendee will be entered into a drawing to actually run the train. The next day, the chaise of the Yosemite Mountain Sugar Pine Railroad will transport us into the forests of pine and sequoia. After a chartered bus takes us from the convention to the mountains, we'll visit their shops, enjoy dinner, and take a four-mile long ride into the woods with a stop halfway for entertainment around the campfire before boarding the bus for the trip back to the convention hotel. We're also planning two and a half days of clinics and already have some great presenters to share both prototype railroading and modeling techniques. Several clinics will focus on the historic logging railroads. Bring your modeling masterpieces for the contests. All the normal categories will be included, as well as an ingenuity and levity contest. Arts and crafts, photos, and People's Choice Awards will also be part of the contest. There are numerous quality model layouts around the Fresno area, and we are arranging visits to a few of them. Jim Neal's Southern Pacific layout includes track from Bakersfield to Mojave. This large multi-level mushroom layout is in a purpose-built 34 by 38 foot building. The layout is fully operational 
with scenery progressing. Bob Jekyll's O-scale layout completely fills its own 34 by 80 foot building. From sea to the Midwest, the layout features 2,694 feet of track for its 117 locomotives and over a thousand freight cars. Tom Davis's O-scale features Lionel locomotives with scratch-built cars on its fully scenic 24 by 36 foot layout. Tom's layout will also be available for operations. So speaking of operations, be, in addition to the layout visits, we are arranging operating sessions on some of the layouts. Sign-ups will be first come, first served through our website. Rob Briney's Sierra Clovis and Western depicts the area around Fresno in the 1970s with Southern Pacific and Santa Fe railroads. Primarily a switching layout, this 13 by 22 foot double deck around the walls layout is ready for operations. Bob Pathaud's Fall Creek Branch is a small switching layout that will be at the convention hotel and available for operating convention operating sessions. Glenn Sutherland's Sierra Railroad is three decks of operations in a 12 by 50 foot space. The depiction of the Sierra Railroad in 1923 is historically accurate, featuring structures and industries of that time. We will end our convention with an awards banquet to be capped off by stories told by Mike Osborne who has worked for both the Southern Pacific and Union Pacific Railroads. Mike has been a model railroader since 1964 with his own operating HO scale layout. Because of COVID-19 and the pandemic, we will take appropriate precautions for the convention. And if we need to cancel, all registrations will be refunded but we need you to register before February 20th, 2021. Don't wait, register now. And we will see you in Fresno.